So with the assembly elections just days away and the BJP then making an all-out go in Jammu and Kashmir, Article 370 has done be become a key issue. The last days of campaigning has seen the BJP tone down the rhetoric, but its refusal then to take a very clear stand is drawing fire from other parties in the state. Amit Shah at a rally in Ramban in the Jammu region, seeking votes for the BJP in the name of development. Jammu Kashmir mein ye chunao sirf vikas ke liye nahi lada ja raha. Jammu Kashmir ka ye chunao Jammu Kashmir ko desh ka ek abhin ang banane ke liye bhi bahut mahatvapurn hai. Desh ke saath chunao ke saath bhi bahut. While the BJP chief steered clear of Article 370, Home Minister Rajnath Singh at a rally in Ladakh brought on the contentious issue. Kabhi Article 370 ka aapko bhai dikha se. Kaise hai BJP aegi. Article 370 ko reveal kar degi. Aur is baar bhi, yehi bhai Jammu Kashmir aur Ladakh ki janta ko dikhaya ja raha. Janta ke andar bhai paida kar ke. Accused of creating a scare over Article 370, Omar Abdullah, after filing his nomination, in turn accused the BJP of speaking in multiple voices. I wish there was one statement coming from the BJP on 370. There are multiple statements depending upon where they're standing. And therefore in Jammu, one hears a different point of view, in Kashmir, one hears another. I'm hoping that when the Prime Minister himself comes here, we'll have some clarity on exactly where they stand on Article 370. After all, just two days earlier, Rajnath Singh raked up Article 370 without taking a clear position. <laughs> With just four days to go for the first phase of polling in Jammu and Kashmir, through charges and counter charges, political parties trying to score against each other. Bureau Report, Times Now.